vrolijke vrienden. Nu, hebben jullie al eens geskyped? Ja. Ja, ja. Maar ja. hebben jullie al eens geskyped met Jeremy Birch? Nee. nee. Oké, okay. ik dacht het al. En daarom heb ik hem voor jullie eens opgebeld. Jeremy is een Australisch computerprogrammeur die ons helpt bij het kanaliseren van onze gevoelens. En hier is hij helemaal live vanuit Australië. Hallo, Jeremy. Hi. G'day, Jeremy. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Where are you at the moment? I'm in Melbourne, Australia right now. Lovely city, lovely city. I'm here with some friends, Yella, Sarah, Tina and Bill. Now they have to guess how you influence their lives on a daily basis. Okay. Okay. He helped you with your feelings. Jeremy, are you yeah. using the internet for uh, to influence us? Yeah. Eh? Probably. Yes. Okay. Yes, I am. Yeah. And can you prove that you're in Melbourne, Australia right now? Because <laughs> <laughs> you can say that, eh? No, I, I, I can't prove that I'm here right now. Ah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jeremy, kom maar op, nee, nee, Sarah. Hij zit in Australië. Misschien kan ik jullie nog een tip geven. Hij maakt dingen die moeilijk overbrengbaar zijn makkelijk. Do you help people um, telling embarrassing stories or embarrassing information to other people? Sometimes. Oh. Yeah. I have no clue. You have no clue. Are you? Are, are you? Do you like write uh, emails yes. for other people? Or something like that? Uh, yeah. No, I don't well, write emails for people. I mean, I you write, write, you write, write like... love letters for other people. No. Mensen die niet graag typen, die lui zijn, mm. mogen hem heel dankbaar zijn. Ah. Ah, do you do speech to text? No. Hij kan ervoor zorgen dat het alfabet mogelijk ooit overbodig wordt. No, don't do that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, em emojis, do you, so you. Uh, you are like a, a designer of. Bill, you have het woord gezegd that we zochten eigenlijk. Ja. Yeah. Ik zal het even zeggen. Jeremy Birch maakt deel uit van het Emoji Comité. Dat is een groep intellectuelen die verbonden zijn met de technologiehoofdstad Silicon Valley. Nu zij hebben zich verenigd voor het goedkeuren en beheren van alle emoji wereldwijd. Nu de foto die je hier ziet, dat is niet betankelijk. Okra in Westwezel, die de nieuwe speellijst. Dat zijn hardcore intellectuelen. Allee, die dus alle emoties die wij versturen naar elkaar, zij gaan bepalen welke worden toegelaten en welke niet. Oh. Nu, emoji zijn vereenvoudigde afbeeldingen die je via je smartphone in een bericht kan versturen, zoals hier. Ze kunnen een voorwerp voorstellen, maar ook een dier of een menselijk figuurtje. Jeremy, everyone's familiar with emoji. But what's the purpose of the committee? Could you explain us, please? To put an emoji on your phone, every company can't just make it up by themselves. The committee needs to approve it first. Otherwise, it won't work between different phones. So the committee, we accept uh, proposals for new emojis, and then every year we approve a new list, and then they can come out on your phone later in the year. And Jeremy, who's on the committee? It's uh, like... So it's people from every company that's to do with emojis. So you have Twitter, you have Facebook, Google, Apple, Emojipedia is my company. So everybody that has something to do with publishing emojis has a person on the committee. Who can propose, like, who can ask to put on a new emoji? Literally anyone. You anyone. can, the audience can, anyone ah. can propose a new emoji. Well, yeah. so, and if you prove that it might be used a lot, then it, it could get on your phone. Uh, if I ask Yellick to draw on a new one, we can uh, show it to you. Maybe it's becoming a new one. Is that like a possibility? <laughs> Okay, I'm going to give him some paper. It would be good to send the paperwork in, but, sure, but you know, let's have a look. Yeah, let's but have we have good uh, connection now, with Jeremy. <laughs> We're all <laughs> together. Ah. Yeah. All right. Anyway, could you tell me about like the most radical uh, emoji that they have uh, proposed that you had to refuse or? Some people got a bit carried away. That a lot of people want uh, animal emojis. People are very keen on getting new animals and birds. Someone proposed 24 different types of dinosaurs. Whoa. So in that the was end, we my just idea. Put on two dinosaurs because it seemed like 24 was too many. Yella is a dinosaur addict, so must be must be him. No, I will yeah. throw something different. Is, and is there is there a new emoji coming that you can tell us about that that, that hasn't mm -hmm. been. Uh, Published yet? Uh, well, this year it's not on your phones, but there's different hair types this year. So there's people with red hair, bald, bald heads, white hair, curly hair. Uh, that's a big one. People have been felt very left out with the red hair in particular. And how does the approval work? If I send you an emoji, how does it work? 
Uh, so the approval works that you send it in. It takes about a year to 18 months where uh, there's the emoji committee that I'm on. We look at it. And if it fills the main criteria that we set out, that it looks distinctive and that people will use it, then we pass it on to the next committee. And if they approve it, it hits the phones about six okay, months later. Okay. But you know, Yellen is going to show you something and you'll have to approve it. Yeah. But he's going to wait for to. a second. <laughs> I'm going to explain okay. just something uh, to the viewers. Ook al worden emoji officieel goedgekeurd, toch kan de interpretatie ervan alleen verschillen. Zo herinnerde deze papa zijn zoon aan het overlijden van zijn onkel met een smakelend lachende emoji, omdat hij dacht dat het traantjes van verdriet waren. Maar om zoiets te voorkomen heeft Jeremy nog iets anders opgericht. So could you tell us about the emojipedia a little bit more? So it's like a dictionary where you, you think, here's an emoji, I don't know what it means or what people are using it for. Some of them are pretty small as well. And if you need glasses, sometimes they're a bit hard to see. Ah. So we'll describe because what they look like on different phones and give you different interpretations of how people use them. Jeremy, Jelle always sends me an eggplant. Well, what does it mean? That I really like <laughs> eggplants. Uh, it means that he, he loves cooking, I think. Ah, He's very exactly. good at cooking. But he always okay. wants sex with me. I don't know why. <laughs> very confusing. So so I, have a, I have a suggestion. Eh? Yeah. <clears throat> something I, when I, I Skype with people or I talk to people and something, no, not in this case, but something I just don't want to say, but just want to show in an emoji, so that's perfect for it. There's something stuck in your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> that's fantastic. <laughs> I like that. Yeah? I like that. Do I you? Think it has potential. Oh, great. And yeah, there's like something in your nose you can do too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like. Very versatile. Something in your beard, maybe as exactly, well. Exactly, yeah, yeah. There's someone behind you who can do that too. <laughs> Jeremy. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Right. What is the success rate of, of uh, Yellow's proposal? And let's be honest, because we know where you live, because you gave us your address. So, yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Well, I think it's, it's a smart not over one. The line yet. I'd love, we'd love it if you submit some paperwork with it. Maybe it's in with a chance. Okay. Can you can put us on top of the paperwork at home? <laughs> maybe in the middle. Okay, in the middle. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jeremy. Thank it you. was lovely to talk to you. <laughs> ciao, ciao. <laughs> Papa, tu emoji preferido cuál es? Eh? Ik vroeg hem wat is uw lievelings emoji en duidelijk het uh, lachend kakska. Oh. <laughs> Mooi hè? Ja, ik, dat is ik, interessant ik, om aan ik, te kijken. Ja, ik ga hem wel, ik ga hem wel eens kunnen gebruiken die mens. Ik, ik heb er moeilijk mee. Ik, 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 heb, ik heb woorden nodig. Nog een papier. Ja. Ja. Maar we zouden één kunnen verzinnen dat geen gezicht is. <laughs> nee? Ja, of de achterkant van het gezicht rond haar. Het zegt veel meer vaak, vind ik. Dus, laat uw achterkant eens zien aan de mensen. En dat, voilà, dat is veel expressiever dan Sarah. Goed, goed. Ja. En wat wil je nu zeggen, Sarah? Ik ben blij. Is er een emoji voor? Op naar het volgende. Op naar het volgende.